Hi everyone, I'm Sarah Kajumko with your political news update for Wednesday, June 29th. Greek lawmakers finally okayed an austerity plan, clearing the way for the country to receive a new ballot package from the European Union. The $40 billion plan is unpopular with the people who continue to riot outside Parliament. The bill contains a mixture of spending cuts and tax increases. Greece said it only had enough money to pay salaries and pensions until mid-July. The governor of Greece's central bank said a no vote on this package would have been suicide for the country. President Obama wants to let Americans know he understands their frustrations about the economy. This morning he will hold a news conference from the East Room of the White House to talk about the job situation, controversy over military action in Libya, as well as debt reduction negotiations. Reporters are invited to the conference to ask any questions they'd like. Obama's last major news conference was in March during the height of the Libya conflict. Bristol Palin says her mom's made up her mind whether she will run for president or not, but her lips are sealed. Sarah Palin herself, however, says she is still undecided no matter what her daughter says. Yesterday, Sarah Palin traveled to Iowa for the premiere of her biographical movie titled Undefeated. The film comes just one day after Michelle Bachman launched her own presidential campaign in the state. And California lawmakers passed a budget last night that will reduce the state shortfall from $26 billion to $5 billion. Governor Jerry Brown says they had to make big cuts, but it puts the state on more stable footing fiscally. And that's your political news update for Wednesday, June 29th. I'm Sarah Kajumko. Check back with RTTnews.com all day for the latest political headlines.